Giorgio, you making fresh ricotta for me brings back so many memories of trips to Italy, just going to these wonderful farmhouses and just collecting warm, fresh ricotta. There's nothing better, right? Absolutely. In my hometown, they, they're selling on the street, the people screaming, the cheese market screaming, ricotta, ricotta. And the lady going there with the plate and they tip it over in the plate. It's oh. so, so characteristic, it's, so, so it's, nice. It's incredible. And just the flavour is incomparable, right? Very fresh. It's yes. always the best. So I thought I'd make you a little ice cream. I love making this for my friends and family. It really showcases ricotta um, in a, a little sweetie, so ice cream. And I thought pistachio is a ricotta, best pistachio friends. Pistachio also is a typical from my yes. town. From There is a very popular pistachio from Bronte, from Sicily, yes. absolutely. It was meant to be then. Yes. Can I ask you You will to bring me back in Sicily today. I'll bring Thank you back you. to Sicily? Yes. <laughs> Can I ask you to please finally chop me some pistachios, pistachios. as you would say. And I'm going to be try. using two of these fresh ricottas. So in they go. About We need about 400 grams for this ice cream. So this is sort of my go-to ice cream. You can add many different flavours, but the ricotta just gives it that creamy, fluffy result that we're after, that we all love about ricotta. So in it goes. Look, it's so fresh. And then instead of sugar, we're going to be using condensed milk because it's sweet it. enough, yeah? I love it. I was buying little tubes. Yeah. And suck it all <laughs> when I was younger, yeah? Like a lolly. Yeah. <laughs> and so what I'm going to do is whisk this together. Now, it doesn't have to be smooth. I kind of like it to be a little curdled, if you like, or a little chunky. So we get those little bits of ricotta and then mix that together. Look at that. This is just so yummy as is. So don't over whisk it. That's just right. Into that. I'm going to add some fresh vanilla, vanilla bean. Bacello di vaniglia. Bacello. What does bacello mean? Bacello is everything is a bean, like the. Ah, bacello. bacello. Okay, there you go, bacello. And I like to use just one of these, and you can really taste the difference in this. Is that all you're chopping me? Ah, sorry, sorry. sorry. <laughs> you're not making me work hard. It's usually you making me work so hard. I actually need all of these. All of these? Yeah, yeah better hurry up. <laughs> you better hurry up, that's right. So one vanilla bean and we'll just take all of that out like that. See how much vanilla seed you can get out from one vanilla bean. So that can now go into our ricotta and give it a whisk and as you whisk that, you can see all the speckles of vanilla. So mm, good. Yummy. So in here we've got some whipped cream. You want it to be just over soft peaks because we're going to be starting to fold it in. So if it's stiff peaks, it may split. So that looks good. And then we simply grab our ricotta and condensed milk mixture. And we'll add half of it. I'm going to fold it in quite gently just to keep as much air as possible so it's really fluffy. You know, usually if you're making ice cream, you need an ice cream machine, right? Okay. Yeah, but this is sort of the cheats way. So if you don't have an ice cream machine, you can still make fantastic ice cream. And that's because we've got that condensed milk in it, the cream, of course, that's been whipped, and the ricotta. You just get that gorgeous, fluffy, creamy result that's not too icy because we don't want it to be icy. Absolutely. <laughs> so I can make this at home? You can make this at home. I know how to make home. the pistachio now, exactly. practically. Yeah. I'm <laughs> an expert. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I don't need to buy a blender for the pistachio next no, time. No, you don't, oh, no. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so this is almost ready. How are you going with the pistachios oh, there? Oh, don't tell me about I'm stressed. <laughs> 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 I think they're OK. They look great. Yeah, it's yeah. A fine one. I like, no, I like it all. I like the, the mixture the of, one. yeah. Too, yeah, beautiful. Yeah, Thank you. Mixture. You're too kind. There we go. I just the colour is so good. A little more. And don't stop here with ricotta and pistachio pistachio. You could also add some chocolate through it. There's so many things some you could add. through it and make Plus. the cassata flavour, ricotta, oh, gelato. That's such a Very great Sicilian idea. Style. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Next one. I'm already excited about it. <laughs> so that's our ice cream mix pretty much ready to go. I've got a 1.5 litre container. So I'll pop that into the container. I'll cover it with some Glad Wrap and then it goes into the freezer to chill completely. Can I get to lick the bowl after? OK, Giorgio, <laughs> no problems. I will too. Have a taste. Yeah. Mmm, delicious. Mmm, it's good, huh? Mm, very nice. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, Giorgio, our non-churn ricotta ice cream has set. It's nicely chilled, frozen. Oh, look at that. See how creamy it is and it's not icy? Absolutely. That's what you want, really. I've got a ice cream scoop here, piping hot water, and shall we have a taste? Uh, looking forward. <laughs> Being white. Let's take this out. Oh, look at all those perfectly chopped pistachios that you've done. So good. Into a little glass bowl. I go in degree in chopping pistachio now. <laughs> you are. And a few more pistachios because why not? On yes. top. Yeah. Shall we share? Yes. Ah. Beauty first. After you. Okay. Your okay. beauty. Go. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. <laughs> mm, see how it's not icy? I love ricotta. Mm, I just love ricotta by itself, but when it's like this with the pistachios, such a simple dessert yet elegant because of its simplicity. Healthy. Healthy. Well, I guess. Why not? Yes, healthy. Yes. Let's say ricotta healthy. healthy. <laughs> Giorgio, thank you so much for showing me how to make ricotta, and I hope you like my thank recipe. Thank you, Justine. Thanks for the gelato. <laughs>